This is the Cavity Flames fan. This is a new episode, and um, I'm going to talk about how much the Winter Classic really sucked this year. Number one, it all started. Well, there was a positive. The alumni game was good at the beginning, in between the old Washington and old Pittsburgh. It, that that was a good game, but the next day was pretty not so good. So, um, they make this game on a Saturday, and usually the Winter Classic is, like, last year was, like, 11 a.m. or 9, but this year they make it 6 o'clock, and it's all dark out, so what's the point of that? Like, why would you have it late? Just, well, I guess a rain delay, but usually the Winter Classics have snow in them, but it had rain, and that was also a bad part of it, too. Another down is Washington won. I didn't really want them to win. I wanted Pittsburgh to win because I just kind of like them more than Washington. But um, also, Sidney Crosby in the second period got injured, so that was pretty bad too. And also that disallowed goal from Pittsburgh, that kind of, yeah, that wasn't that good. So which, um, let's talk about the jerseys now. Which jersey did you like better? I like Washington's because this was a little bit better. But, um, which was, um, your favorite out of them? So you can leave a comment on that. But another one that you could leave is, um, which one of classic jersey of Pittsburgh's did you like better? The first one against Buffalo or the last one against, um, Washington. But um my one on the two Pittsburgh ones it have to be the the first one. And that was actually a good game the first one. It was snow, it was early, it was like old fashioned hockey. It went to a shootout and it was a good game. Okay, so we all know how um that well I think that wasn't the best one at classic. I don't think it was worse. I mean I don't think it was like horrible. I just don't think it was that good. So, um, pretty much, um, now let's talk about, now that we know, now that I talked about the Winter Classic, how bad it was, I'm going to talk about the Heritage Classic now. So, I'm pretty excited for the Heritage Classic because, well, the Calgary Flames and the Montreal Canadiens are playing in it, and um, uh, the Montreal jerseys aren't that special, but Calgary's, I like theirs. I also hope that it's going to be snowy and all that, so then it will be, um, you know, like old time hockey. And it's um, the alumni game is going to be really good because um, they got Theo Fleury, Mike Vernon, there was a really weird story about him. He's only going to play half of the game and there's only two periods. So he's only going to play a period and a half. So Calgary now has to find another one of their old goaltenders. And just today I found something interesting. Conroy, Craig Conroy was put on waivers and it was either nobody claimed him now. So now his decision is to retire or go to Abbotsford. If I was him I'd retire. But the second part I was going to talk about that was um, Craig Conway. If uh, he retires, he has a chance to be in the alumni game. Like, wow. He's he's too young to be in the alumni game. Like, he would, like, skate through everybody. And whatever. So I don't think that's a good decision if they put him in the alumni game. But anyway, um... This is the Calgary Flames fan, and the first part I talked about the Winter Classic, talking about it wasn't that good, and I hope the Flames win against Montreal and um, in McMahon Stadium, home of the Calgary Stampeders. Go Stamps, by the way. And um, I hope that they don't have to come back from four to nothing that they did against, um, you know, 
Montreal. So um, this is the Calgary Flames fan saying bye.